If you've been a good little internaut and watched my Vocaloid series, and you're sitting here watching this, then I assume that I've won you over with the sweet siren songs of the Vocaloids. Or you just found this video on a random search and you're bored. Well, either way, in this video I'll teach you how to find Vocaloid music, music videos, and MP3s. Obviously, YouTube has many Vocaloid songs, and it's perfectly fine to find Vocaloid music here when you're just starting out. The problem with using YouTube to find music of any kind is that YouTube heavily compresses the audio portion of videos, so if you want to listen to music of higher quality, you'll have to venture out to other strange new places. I have mentioned the site Nico Nico in my Vocaloid series many times. It is basically a Japanese equivalent of YouTube, but since it hosts so many music videos, and because music is so important in Japanese culture, Nico Nico does not compress audio as much as YouTube does. This means that when you watch a song on Nico Nico, it actually sounds good. What a concept. Yes, Nico Nico is a Japanese site. So if you know absolutely no moon language at all, you will feel a bit out of place. Luckily, last year Nico Nico created an English side for their site for us international fans. So creating and managing your account is much easier than it was a couple years ago. An account is required to view videos there but it's a quick and easy process, and as I will soon explain, it is very much worth it. Aside from Nico Nico's main page, which is where you can search for specific Vocaloids by name, Nico Nico has a home page for Vocaloid music in general. It has a current five popular video section, a genre search section, and even a section that shows good songs that don't have too many hits yet. This is a great page for staying up to date on new Vocaloid songs, and a Nico Nico account is required to watch the videos it links to, so that's why I think you should make an account. A Nico Nico account is also very useful for finding higher quality versions of videos you find on YouTube. There are many people on YouTube who download and post videos from Nico Nico to YouTube, and sometimes they don't upload higher quality versions, or sometimes the videos are removed from YouTube altogether. With a little detective work, you can usually find the originals on Nico Nico and then watch them or download them yourself with the Firefox extension NicoFox. There are a couple things to mention about Nico Nico to those who have never used the site before. Firstly, even though there is an English side of the site now, all of the videos are still hosted in Japan. This means that during peak Japanese usage times, the videos switch to economy mode, which is basically their version of low quality. Since Japan is on the other side of the world, this means that the best time to download or watch the normal and high quality videos on Nico Nico is around noon here in the US, with a few hours in either direction. If you're a night owl like me, and try to watch videos from Nico Nico at midnight in the US, chances are the site will be quite busy and Nico Fox automatically refuses to download low quality files, so it will wait until the site is less busy to get the regular quality videos. You can override this if you wish, of course. Secondly, comments do not work the same way on Nico Nico as they do on YouTube. Nico Nico video comments are actually placed on the videos themselves, at the current time the person types out the comment in relation to where in the video they currently are. The comments scroll from right to left, and they can be quite distracting. You can disable these comments with a button on the videos. The English and Japanese sides of the site have their own comments for each video, but it's still common to see simple Japanese comments in the English section, typically posted by foreigners for the benefit of any Japanese users peeking at the English side of the site. But if you're not interested in videos and you only want MP3s of Vocaloid music, you can mostly bypass Nico Nico and go to a related website, Nico Sound. I don't know if Nico Sound is officially affiliated with Nico Nico. But regardless, it hosts MP3s of many videos posted to Nico Nico, whether they're Vocaloid related or not. If you find a particular video on Nico Nico you want the music for, you can paste a link to the video in this search bar, and it will take you to that video's page along with a link to its MP3. The majority of these are of good quality, but they depend on the quality of the video on Nico Nico, so you can see the bitrate, length, and other information of the MP3 file here. Just click the term MP3 under the little graph to download the MP3. If you want to avoid Nico Nico altogether, you can use the top search bar to search Nico Sound for song titles or Vocaloid names. Sometimes English will work, 
but you'll want to use Japanese if you can. I'll include Japanese for the various Vocaloids in the video description so you can copy paste them. Nico Nico and Nico Sound also make use of tags for videos and songs, so you can probably do fine with that. If you find a song by an artist you like, for example, you can click the tag for that artist and see the rest of his or her songs. Nico Sound by default lists the songs by popularity if you click on a tag, so this is also an easy way to check out the most popular songs by the lesser used Vocaloids if you're interested in them. There are no doubt many other places to find Vocaloid music, and there are likely better places to find songs made by the English Vocaloids, but the Japanese produce most Vocaloid based music even for non-Japanese Vocaloids, so I believe these two sites will keep you sated for a while. If you know of any sites that are geared toward the English or other non-Japanese Vocaloids specifically, let me know. The rest of this video will be about something that is only somewhat Vocaloid related, but it's something I enjoy quite a bit nonetheless. I was going to ask a hypothetical question and do this whole bit to introduce this topic, but I'm feeling a bit lazy so we'll do things the easy way. As you may be aware, karaoke, or more properly, karaoke, is a popular pastime in Japan for people of all ages and social standings. Some people sing for themselves, but it's usually an event for socializing. Instead of a regular bar or restaurant, Japanese businessmen and women often get together with co-workers after a long day and sing and drink the night away at a karaoke box. There are even karaoke coaches available to tutor those who want to improve their abilities. Music is important to the Japanese, and karaoke helped develop their culture to be very comfortable with amateur singing. Certainly we in the West love music, and singers as well, but we hold amateurs in higher esteem if they sing original, or at least older songs, rather than popular ones that are currently in the limelight, or ones that everyone knows. But Japanese karaoke songs were traditionally made up of popular songs. After all, with the older technology of the 70s and 80s, it took a bit more effort to produce karaoke tapes. They couldn't stream songs from the internet or rely on mp3s and video files like we can today. Singing popular songs was the norm, and this means that not only are there many amateur singers who share their talents on places like Nico Nico, but many of them also sing Vocaloid songs. For example, here is the beginning of a Vocaloid medley by a singer named Ritsuka. The original video is nearly 40 minutes, and she plays the guitar and sings dozens of Vocaloid songs in this time frame, but I'm only going to show the first song, which, coincidentally, is Rolling Girl. She does an amazing job with the other songs as well. But this portion of my video is not simply about amateur singers covering Vocaloid songs. One day I stumbled on a video by a group known as Vocalite. This video was a group of seven people singing a Miku song, Time Machine. Oh, 
This group did a great job with the song and the music, and it introduced me to the concept of Niku Niku Chorus, a subgenre of Niku Niku's amateur scene that involves multiple pe people singing the songs. But unlike the Vocalite song, many of these Niku Niku Chorus videos are mixed by strangers. That is, someone downloads multiple singers' versions of a song and then mixes them together without their involvement. This sounds like a recipe for disaster, but the results may surprise you. So here are some of my favorite Nico Nico chorus renditions. Note that the placement of the icons for the singers is not random. Typically, they represent their alignment in terms of left, right, and center channels. Shine, 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 shine,